Hey guys, today I'm going to walk you through the new creator tools feature coming up in the next version of Odd Caliber. What it is, is a means to help creators publish and share their mods in a way that VOD Caliber will support a lot more or easier, I guess. I don't know. Um, what it'll do is quickly package up the mods, the custom strings, and the thumbnails as they've been set up in your VOD Caliber. And then you can share it super simply with anyone, post it on Discord, whatever, and they can just drag and drop it into their auto install folder. It'll install everything exactly as it's set up, which is great. So it takes a lot of the headache out for users who are maybe less computer literate. So yeah, anyway, getting right into it. You can access it in the file mods menu here up in the options drop down here at the creator tools and it'll open right up. Otherwise, you can also access it within the custom strings, which may be the preferred option if you do need to make changes throughout. Um, the actual creator tools UI, as far as the custom strings are concerned, is simply read-only. So, yeah, we're going to open it up. The only mod type currently supported is Equipment CDLC. The other tool stuff will be coming at a later date. Um, yeah, so there's two types of CDLC equipment packaging that will be supported. Hot loading mods, since Kempro prefers those, I've added that in there. And then pack based mods, which is what we're going to go over here today. Um, I'm going to demonstrate using the 2P hair pack by Luxatio Studios. And I've already got everything set up. Everything's got thumbnails, we've got info, just in case, whatever. So. What I'm going to do now is click down here and search for the pack, which I've already got it installed right here. And then you'll see these two options light up so we can create the VK pack, which is what you would share onto Discord. So if we click that, it'll quickly zip everything up and open your Explorer. And then you can share this, the VK pack, and then users will be able to drag and drop that into their auto install folder here by their EXE, the mod caliber and it'll quickly install the mod, the custom strings, and thumbnails all in one go. And if there are any conflicts, like they already have a set that's called the Terra 2B hair pack, it'll ask if they want to override it. Same with the mod itself. Um, yeah, so it will take a lot of the heartache out for computer, li computer illiterate users, you know. And then we've also got the release within mod caliber here. In here, there's a view tutorial button, which is what I'm filming now, so shut up about it. Um, we've also got a little note here. You will need access to my Airtable and Dropbox folders, which is where I store all of the information that's used within VOD Caliber as far as mods. So very first step is to upload the thumbnails to the Dropbox. So if you click this button here, it'll open up Dropbox and the thumbnails as they are needed for your group as it is. So if you make any changes, you're going to need to restart this process um, before you post to Airtable. Otherwise, there will be problems. <laughs> um, so you'll notice I can't drag and drop, and that's because Windows is the big dumb and has permission issues. So if you already have a tab on Google Chrome open, um, things that are not okay. Um, anyway, so I'll just minimize that and then open Dropbox again. It'll open this tab and then you should be able to drag and drop. Um, that's not what I wanted there, sir. There we go. So, yep, it'll upload everything. And you don't need to do anything else, so you can actually just close this tab. I'm going to leave it open just because of, you know, Windows issues. And then here we need to upload the pack. If you've already got the pack uploaded on your own server or your own Dropbox, you are more than welcome to do so, but you can also use my Dropbox. I've got a lot of storage that I will have no problem sharing. <laughs> um, anyway. Yeah, so we're going to click on open Dropbox. Again, it'll open the Dropbox folder we're going to need to paste it in, and it'll navigate to the 
package you selected earlier. So we're going to just drop it in here. Now these are set up by the set names more or less. So if something is the same name, just, you know, don't overwrite it. Make a copy and change the name as needed. The name of this guy isn't as important. But what we're going to need to do here is right click and then copy link. And then it'll create a link that we're going to then go back in here and click right here. And it'll automatically change it to a direct download variant of the link. And then we're good to go ahead and generate information and open Airtable. So again, it'll, oh, it'll ask for the version of your mod. I don't know if this has a version, so we're just going to go with 1.0. Oh. Then it's going to upload this specific table within Airtable. So all you'll need to do is click this button. If there does happen to be mods already here, you can just click down here to add a new blank line. Um, all we're going to do is hit Control V and it'll ask you if you want to expand. You are going to hit, or yes, yes expand and hit continue. And it'll quickly paste all of the information as you've set it up in the formatting that Airtable needs. And then as long as everything looks good, just give it a quick once over, make sure the paths are good, whatever, whatever. We are gonna be able to go over here and hit approved. And all the approved really means is that it is currently live within VOD Caliber. So if we go over here and restart, in approximately five to seven years, it'll open up and let us know that there is a new mod available. So I'm probably gonna speed this up. There we go, just like that. We have published new mods within VOD Caliber. I really, really like that it drew <laughs> <laughs> uh, drew the preview with the generic images instead of using it. That's a cute little bug that I will squash later. I'm just going to show you real quick what installing the VK pack does. So we're just going to click, scroll up here, scroll up, scroll up faster please, and drop into the auto install. And there you go. They are installed. So if we Go open our custom strings. There's the custom strings as we had them set up. I'm gonna go ahead and delete that again because I don't like duplicates and it's already bugging me really bad. And then we're gonna go here to your file mods and VOD Caliber installs, and there is the pack that we installed. Thanks for watching. Happy sharing.